talk to Max or something. Life's too soon. We ain't allowed to kill any of them. So, tell me, did you have to wait in a long line to see me? No. I'll walk right up there. Exactly. Mo, if you can handle the same shit, but I'm bothering me about it. You need help finding your place here? No. No! I can handle it. There's plenty of collars in the kennels if you can. Now that I get a closer look at you, not sure I'm buying this new overboss thing. <laughs> as long as you care about yourself, you'll do what I tell you. Ah, you might make it out of here alive after all. Name's Mason, the Pax Alpha. This here's our side of town. You might be overboss, for now. But I'm the boss of the pack, and it's gonna stay that way. Long as you don't go forgetting that, we're gonna be fine. I'm not here to make us friends. I'm here to make us some caps. I think we can all respect caps, if not each other. Look, it ain't like anyone's broke up about Coulter. Just figured on his replacement being, well, different. But Gage says you're the boss now, so you're the boss. Coulter was weak. Why'd you follow him at all? Been wondering that ourselves. Don't get me wrong, Coulter was definitely overboss. Not a man to mess with. And things were good in the beginning. Real good. But that was a year ago. Then Coulter went soft. Wanted to take stock in what we achieved. I think you're a bunch of ungrateful children. Careful there, boss. We ain't ungrateful. Just fed up. Sure, this place beats living in the shitholes we had out there. But it ain't the palace of cats we signed up for. Ain't none of us happy. Not even the disciples. And they're normally a chipper bunch so long as they're drenched in blood. Things were going to hell fast, but Gage put the brakes on that. He got us together and promised he'd find someone to deal with Colter. I'm not Colter, so that better not happen to me. Yeah, sure, boss. I get it. I do. We're totally willing to give you a chance. We are. Look, let's cut to the chase. You gonna do right by the pack. I hear you've been talking to the other gangs. Don't worry. You'll get your fair share of the caps. Sure, fine. But it ain't just about the caps. It's also about respect. If you want to set your heel, we expect to be top dogs around here. One last thing before I let you go. There's always work to do around here, keeping the zoo in order. If you're ever able to lend a hand, drop by. Loyalty's a two-way street. It ain't easy keeping the zoo. We all do. If you can take something, it's yours.
Gage. The overboss returns. Well, you're back in one piece. That's a good sign. Everything all peachy with our friendly neighborhood psychopath? Sure hope you didn't promise them too much. I mean, going a little over the top is part of the game, but you don't want them holding it against you if you can't deliver. They'll do what they're told. That's all that matters. Oh boy, okay. Time to roll up your sleeves, boss. There's work to be done. This place is huge. Divided up into sections. Parks, whatever the hell they called them back in the day. We need to take them all back. One at a time. Every section we secure gives us a little more breathing room and more resources. You stake a claim, plant a little flag for one of the gangs, and that settles it. It's theirs for good. Who gets what, that'll be your call. Whoever you hand it off to will appreciate it, but the others might get a little jealous. You know how it goes. Forget the rest of the parks. We've got enough space here. Oh, now, come on. Ain't you been listening? That's exactly the kind of shit we heard all the time from Coulter. Trust me, we need the space. So that's it. Nice and simple, right? Take a minute. Settle in if you want. And then let's get to it. And hey, we're in this together. So I might as well go all in. You want me watching your back? You just say the word. No thanks. I got this. Suit yourself. Change your mind. I'll be around. <laughs> so many chumps. 